we don't have time to fiddle around with getting this country off the dime and getting us back in the future business. Now at 10, former President Bill Clinton is here in Dayton making his case for his wife to become our next commander in chief. Now at 10, less than a week until Ohio's primary and a Democratic powerhouse campaigns in the Miami Valley. Former President Bill Clinton speaking to a sold out crowd at a Democratic fundraiser in downtown Dayton tonight. And 2 News reporter Robert Lowry live with his message to the voters. That's right, Mark. It was a sold out crowd here at the Dayton Convention Center. Dayton, actually, the last stop as former President Bill Clinton tours Ohio, stumping for his wife Hillary as part of her campaign. In a crowd of about 500 Montgomery County Democrats, Bill Clinton saying that if Hillary wins Ohio, she will be, go she will be going on to win the White House. You feel like that's what you want to do. Thank you. A full house standing in applause for former President Bill Clinton as he speaks in Dayton. I had my tickets before I even knew he was coming, but once I found out he was coming, I was excited. The whole atmosphere of him being here was really awesome. Um, he's just so uh, energetic. The former president in town finishing a day of campaigning for Hillary as she looks to take Ohio in next week's primary. I want you to vote for her because she's the best change maker I ever knew. And because we don't have time to fiddle around with getting this country off the dime and getting us back in the future business. For about half an hour, Clinton hit several points on his wife's campaign. He spoke about Hillary's plan to increase manufacturing jobs in America and raise income without sacrificing employment. He also spoke about Hillary's drive to make the country better for the future, helping college students with debt and rebuilding an aged infrastructure. Before that can happen, the former president urged people to get out on Tuesday to vote. Because if Ohio supports her and gives her a victory in a week, she will be nominated, and I believe she will be the next president, and that will be a very good thing for America. Something this sold-out crowd hopes will come to fruition. As far as, like, colleges and stuff, um, how, how that was explained this evening from Bill's standpoint, I definitely would vote for her. And I'm proud that she not ashamed to back the policies that our president had put forth and that she want to continue them so that the country can continue to move forward. And the Clinton campaign saying that they will stay pretty busy in Ohio leading up to Tuesday's primary, especially making sure that they can win Ohio after their challenger, Senator Bernie Sanders, came out with that win in neighboring Michigan just last night. Reporting live, Robert Lowry, 2 News, working for you.